Hey y'all, it's Priscilla Love back again with another video. You already know what's going on. I'm excited to tell you guys we are about to get a winner for my first giveaway for my channel for the moving bar for the 500 subscribers. We're now at 675 subscribers, y'all, which is so crazy to me. Like, I'm really, really, really close to a thousand subscribers and this has just been a journey. Like I've always wanted to do YouTube. This, it really warms my heart and I'm happy and I'm proud of myself. I'm becoming more consistent. So expect more from me. And let me know what y'all want to see too. Like I'm all for like being super authentic, just doing what I already do anyway. The only thing I'm doing is just recording it for you guys, editing it and putting it up. This is just really my life. But if there's certain videos you want to see, certain things you want to know, it could really be about anything. I'm always gonna be honest and I'm always gonna give y'all the tea, okay? Anyway, I am about to pick a winner. I was trying to use one of those generator things, but what I'm gonna do is just like scroll through the comments and then just randomly pick a subscriber to win the giveaway. And then the next giveaway, I'll probably figure out another way to do it. So, <laughs> okay, here we go. This is the phone. I have everything up. And okay, the comment that I landed on is you see that comment right there, Deja Z7990. So, congrats! We have a winner of the first giveaway, Deja Z. I will be reaching out to you, girl, to give you, yeah, I think it's a girl, yeah, definitely it's a girl to reach out to you about when you will receive your shoes and make sure I have the correct sizing and everything. Thank you so much for everyone that participated in the giveaway. And this video today will be a continuation of my moving vlog. There's a lot of moving parts when moving in and I showed everything. So keep watching if you're interested. See you guys later. What do she do? I do everything. I move everything. I am not looking for clout, no. I knew I would figure it out. I knew. I took the mean around right now. So today I'm gonna try to put up my berry string lights and I'm using these command strips to go on the outside. They're outdoor ones. I just wanted to show you guys. I've had these for a while. This is what they look like. So hopefully it actually stays up because I have like a little smooth part that I'm gonna try to stick it to, but we'll see. I thought these were bigger bulbs. Um, so I'm a little, eh. I don't know how I feel about that. But then again, it's really, really long and it comes with a lot of them. And my balcony is kind of big. So I feel like it should work out fine, but we'll see. My next project is a Dollar Tree hat. I have this garden tool hanger from Dollar Tree, Dollar 25, and I'm gonna try to make a space for all my brooms, brushes, swiffers, and everything in between to hide it and categorize it nicely. But cheap, okay. Now we'll be using this command strip. The velcro ones to try to put it up there should we have one cut out here and about two of them they do have the color white which i saw after the fact when i went back the other day
as you guys saw i used one set of the velcro command strip but i do suggest using two but with the one it was able to hold up two brooms and one swiffer but it worked out perfect so y'all i just want to show y'all what my cabinet looks like before i redo it so i got some i had stole like some of my mama and daddy's china i ain't gonna lie so i stole like one big spoon one fork one knife and then one like teaspoon but then i was like okay i need to buy my own so i went to walmart and i got these for super cheap they're yeah, stainless steel and these were so cheap you guys like i went to belks and just pennies to look for silverware like 150 dollars for some silverware baby i don't need no fine china no it's okay so this is what it looks like before and i'm gonna show you what it looks like after when i open this up and put all my little things up in here so i'm super excited to see what it looks like while she's in the dishwasher and then when they're done i'm gonna put everything out so she is washed and ready to go and i dried her down so I just want to show you guys that it does extend out to the size of your cabinet. You can have it like this if you want, or you can extend it out. There's a version that just comes with this part and it doesn't come with the extender that's like $3 cheaper on Amazon. So yeah, but I like this one because I have more space for more teens. Um, I'm also going to get those little cabinet knobs, those clear ones that stick on the bottom. I'm going to buy a pack of those just so she's not sliding all over the place. So once that comes in from Amazon, I'm gonna show you guys the final look. I just took out the utensils, just dried them off. Okay guys, so this is what it looks like. I decided to put all my forks here and I did big, big spoons right here and then little spoons because I had enough space. My little knives, butter knives. And then once I get more of my utensils, um, I'm going to put them all in here, just stack them here. I decided to put my cups, they all fit like within each other um, in here. And this is the little loop that holds them together, but I'll probably just put that back here. I don't really need that. My strainer right here. Yeah. And so it looks super cute. I love the clear, you know, I love clear and I like I got the stainless steel silver, the chrome, it kind of goes with the whole vibe in my living area, kitchen and um, living room with my silver. So I really like it. So when those little sticker thingies come, I'm gonna stick it down. I have to find them for you. This is what they look like. So it's like rubbery, but it has a 3M on the back. So it's sticky on this end. So this helps things not to slide around. And I would use this, but this came with the one for my organizers for my vanity these things so um i have to use these for this but i'm gonna buy another pack from amazon they're like four or five dollars on there for like a pack of like a hundred so i'll have enough for just putting other stuff around my apartment so yes guys y'all i just got my etsy order so i'm gonna unbox it with you but this is what the seller said so cute i like little personalized messages Ooh. So it's hand crafted, hand knitted. Oh, how cute. How stinking, stinking cute is that? Yay, I love it. It's the evil eye pillow. And it's knitted. Perfect. And it matches my evil eye that I got in Turkey. My magnet. So I really like these. I, I, I learned the meaning of them. And I had an evil eye keychain. And I kid you not, one day when I was out, the keychain broke. So the whole thing about evil eyes is that it's supposed to protect you from negative entities, spirits, people, things like that. So yeah. Yay. It goes perfect. Oh, I love that. First, I wasn't gonna have this one here, and I was just gonna have just that. Let me know, guys. Let me know in the comment, guys, what you like better: just the pink chair with the blue eye, or both? Hey, guys, we're at IKEA. 
All right, so we're gonna go upstairs and first thing on my list, I need to get some pillows. So I'm gonna get some pillows. And then I also need to look for a floor length mirror. Um, you guys probably heard of like the Hobbit mirror. That's a really popular one. So they said they have it in stock, but my car, I don't know if it's gonna fit in my car. So I'm gonna check and see how big the box is. And then on top of that, like I, I've been looking on Facebook Marketplace for one, for cheaper, but they just sell out so fast. Look at some pillows like this. There's some decorative pillows. No, these are too small. Let's look for some more. Ooh, these ones are nice. Yeah, trying to do the little thingy. I like those right there. Those are cute. Okay, y'all. This is the size pillow I'm gonna get. It's a 20 by 20. So this will go on my bed. And it's the the drawer. Eight dollars. So we gotta go to home. Marketplace home textile to get it. So let's go find it. We're gonna get two of those and then I need some king pillows I might get a pillow cover too like this. This is cute. I love that If they had it like in pink, I think I'll get that for my bed Found it guys I'll get two of these Yay! So now I just have to find covers and I'm not seeing the ones I actually really like. See these. I saw this one right here. I really like this one. What do you guys think? This one or the other white one that I showed? I have to see if I can find the cover. Wish me luck. This is like a maze though. Like if you get claustrophobic, I don't know. This place might not be it for you. This is nice. Look at these little shelves. Oh my gosh. I like that. Hmm. Thank you. Not a shower. Love that. This is like a studio apartment style. So I found the pillows, the big pillows, because I need two king size pillows, um, which is this kind. But this is the high kind. I need this, and I cannot find it. Like, and then I think that the light blue color means the low, because these are the low ones. But this is a queen. So I already got one. I'm debating if I want to get two, because twenty dollars for one pillow. Uh, I'm thinking about getting one and then like two kings for the back because I have like one bamboo pillow that I really like that I still use but I do want to switch out all the other ones but girl turn it off on one pillow who Jesus um and then they have different prices so I'm just very confused Cause that one right there is like $19.99, but this is the same pillow, Run Trav, $16.99. Y'all, oh, look at this bamboo. I just bought me some in a really cute shape, but this shape is so cute too. And I want a cactus, and these are actually really good. They're only $3.99, they come with three. But do I need three? I don't know how I feel about live plants, y'all. I'm already, I said three live plants the most. If I get these three, then I'm gonna have like four live plants. No, five live plants. And that's just too many <laughs> to keep up with y'all. All right, y'all, I am in um, pillow heaven, as you can see. I found the pillow that I needed. So I'm getting one queen of the lunch round two of Scrogo Fraskin. Fraskin. 
and king so two king and then two queen and the reason i'm doing that is because i already have a pillowcase that goes on my bedding that is the queen size so i'm just gonna get my bedding and then two king pillowcases to go with it um because my mama said king looked better on a queen size bed it just makes your bedding look more grand and then these will just fit in the middle but i have like the other little decorative pillows that's gonna kind of cover it up so it's gonna look nice the concern is i hate getting high pillows guys because i'm a side sleeper but i cannot sleep with my head my body and my neck too high off the the bed like it hurts my neck so bad so on the little diagram it says that the luntran which is this one which is a little pillow is best for people who sleep on their face like face sleepers but i'm just gonna try it because you can always return it so yeah that's what we're gonna do y'all so i found the cushion cover aisle and this is the one i have in my cart right now for my bed i like that one but i saw another one i really really like it was like a light pink kind of almost didn't even look pink kind of almost looked like that but it wasn't let me see if they have it i hope they have it and then i saw this one i showed y'all i really do like that one that's cute Yes, perfect. Awesome. Yes, I just need two. Okay. Oh my All gosh, right. I appreciate you. <laughs> no problem. I don't know why it looked pink to me, but yeah, it is pink. <laughs> I like the color though. That'll work. Awesome. Thank you. <laughs> Y'all, he was so nice. I was looking for these. They look pink to me, but I don't think they're pink. Let me show you. But they look so good. They look light, really, really light pink-ish. So I think I like them better than this. And it's kind of like metallic -y looking. It's super cute, cause the other pink was just too dark. I mean, it would've went, but it just was not the vibe. <laughs> so tell me what y'all think. Cause y'all saw the other pink, like which one do y'all like more? Y'all, I really like this doormat. You know, it's kind of like organic looking. It looks really cool, I like patterns. But, do y'all think I should get this? That one's cute over there too, you see? Ooh, this one. That's cute. What? I don't know. Y'all, just found the cutest vase. I wanted one of these little bottleneck vases. Only $149, so she's coming with me. Y'all, so I just used this to find this mirror, cause who? Who couldn't be looking all over the place? So we gotta go to aisle zero one, shelf 85. This All right guys, so I found the mirror. This is her. I think she'll be perfect, honestly. She looks wide enough, she looks big enough, and she's really good for the price. So this is me driving home, guys. I did not get the Ikea mirror at Ikea. It was too big. I'm gonna give myself a couple more days to see if I can find one on Facebook Marketplace and let you guys know. I told you guys in Ikea I ordered some bamboo which is so crazy you can order plants online but i got this on etsy and it's the heart shaped bamboo i love bamboo so hopefully i can keep this one alive because my last one did die <laughs> good morning lovers it is what time what time is it 9 29 a.m i am actually late but guess what y'all girl found guess what guess what your girl found somebody with the hovid mirror on facebook marketplace so my vlog um the other day it was yesterday no actually it was thursday yeah thursday i went to ikea did a little ikea vlog and saw the mirror and i was like okay i have a week to find somebody else with this mirror if i don't find anybody else then i'm just gonna go to ikea pick it up from there and then just have a ship from store so it'll be cheaper for the shipping because shipping is like 50 dollars. so thank god i actually did find somebody yesterday i messaged them immediately which this is my third time finding someone messaging them and then they not responding or the mirror was already sold it was a black girl so 
<laughs> I'd be so excited. Uh, she messaged me back immediately and she was like, yeah, you can get the mirror. So, but I had to get my friend to come and help me move it because she has a big truck. It was not going to fit in my car. When I went to Ikea, I saw that it was not going to fit. Trust me, y'all. I done been to Ikea and I tried to fit a whole couch. I bought the couch, took it. If you watch my other vlogs, you know. So I was like, yeah, I'm not going to be able to fit that mirror in there. I already know. I learned my lesson. So yeah, that's her texting me right now. The girl. But um, it's only like 10 minutes up the road. I don't know. Because I don't want that girl weighing on me. But yes, y'all. I'm so excited. So let me show you guys where the mirror is going to go. Here. And this is my... Well, I haven't showed y'all yet. But that's my tree. So I'm going to go ahead and move her out the way. Even though I think she's still gonna go right there. We'll see when I get back. And I've already measured it off and I like that because she's gonna cover this because this doesn't really do anything because it goes to that light right there but you have to put like a, a light fixture there if you wanted to. My mirror was like the last biggest purchase that I had to get. Um, and I was really nervous about it because I was like, how am I going to get it out? But yay, so I'm going to try to vlog this. Getting my COVID mirror from Ikea. Oh, y'all, and I forgot to tell you the price. So the price is $90. So I'm really saving over $100 because it's $160 online. Tax is like $13.28. And then the shipping online was $50. But the shipping in store would have been $25. So... I'm really saving so much money and I'm still getting what I want and that's how you do it ladies okay pay full price for what for what that money could be going towards something else like I've been spending so much money but this apartment has to be perfect or I would not be able to sleep well I'm telling you so I'm gonna see y'all guys later when I get there Chief had a flight nigga can't even see me on way out of here I'm too far in the sky heard me this ass for the time my ass Y'all, so we're here at the Kroger's, so I think we found, I think, that gotta be her. Is that a rogue? Back I think that's right her. Behind her. <laughs> Yay, guys. No, I don't see no guys. Nobody's in there. No, I was trying to move because she said we're going to have to slide it between. Okay. Okay. You in a pretty car. <laughs> Y'all, we are in Walmart, so I'm just getting some teams. I don't know if I should get this big one. Y'all, nobody sell the Hawaiian bread um, buns. Yes, I love the buns. You don't never see like them like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So empty in the morning times. Wow. This one? Yeah, I always go to these ones. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gracias. Good day. I know you told her hey two times. She's looking at you. She said I ain't wasting my breath on you. I'm not like. today, I'm not no more. I can't. I'm she said all these people that watch this though, I'm not speaking to everybody. You heard me say good morning. It's just something about people not telling me good morning. I know she could at least she could at least smile. She could at least gave us a grandma Boy. smile. She just looked dead at us. Pretty sweating. <laughs> yeah, look at the mirror. There was no way in here I was getting that shit in my car. There was no, no way. way. <laughs> I'm like, I'm just thankful that my seat's broke down because I was like, city. bro, if I get out to this parking lot and I'm in the parking lot with this damn man, <laughs> I'm in the parking lot standing so crazy with that damn mirror. What's your zoo, that you calling me daddy. Parking on shit, turning up and I get Came out the gutter, they never me to swag Secure the bag, out a bitch, I'm a bag Turning it up, got a rent, she good. Parker two million in the middle of my hood. Taking no mud, I made out of the sewer. I love watching the workers work. That shit really crazy as fuck. <laughs> Look at our pictures. Oh my gosh, Alexis. <laughs> I was like, who is that? That looks like a classic ass photo. <laughs> Your past doesn't define you, everyone. Oh, wow. So fire. Look at Rosa Park. That's a baddie's beach. It's super cute. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh wow. 
my shit, turn it up and I get Came out the gutter, they ain't never me to swag Secure the bag, got a bitch, I'm a bag Turning it up, got a mention, she good Perk a two mil in the middle of my hood Drinking the mud, I made out of the soul My heart accessories Thank you Look at that I'm all good Out of these niggas, they lookin' the same They callin' my lingo, they bite in my chain Championship, championship, man, just gon' have to shit Big break a neck, just a look at the kid I'm gonna call my mama on the way home, see how she's feeling. Yeah, I am. Me and you, your mama and your cousin too. <laughs> Not the go-to. Hey guys, so I have a little goodie to show you guys. And just from the looks of it, can you guess what this is gonna be? <laughs> looks like a whole bunch of nothing right now. But your girl copped her some of those designer books. How fucking cute is that? I had to get a one that had Beyonce on it, of course. This is a Virgo's house, okay? I actually got mine off of um, AliExpress. Um, and I'm gonna show you, I have like a couple of them and you put them together in different ways. So I'm just gonna show you the three ways that I have here. Super, super simple. So for this first way, um, the book itself is kind of folded up like this. So you'll basically just bend on the perforated lines. So I'm just getting it like that, okay, to kind of give it the book shape. The rest is pretty simple. So you will take the inner corners, fold it in, fold it in, and then tuck this in like a cereal box, bend on the line, and then boom. Super simple. There's no um, instructions for this, so I just kind of had to play around with it a little bit to figure it out. Okay, period. So yes, looks like this. Of course, this is like a real book from the side, but who cares? <laughs> We're coming, for, it's for the looks, it's for the aesthetic. And then it has like the little tape pieces, double-sided tape pieces here. You just peel that box. You bend the book in and you place her down like that. Isn't that like genius? Yeah, that's what I got. So that's one version. And honestly, I'm going to tell you guys this now. I don't really like this version of the books I have because these are literally only for decor. Like, they serve no purpose. I like things that serve a purpose. So I'm going to show you this next one that I have. And it's a little different version. I'm going to show you how you put this one together. So these two sides go up to make the side book. Then there is double-sided tape on the little corner tab. So bend that in a little bit. Okay. And then these sides go up. So it, this goes in the inside. And we'll let me show you on this side. That goes on the inside. Then I'll do this side. Bend her up. Okay cute 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 i can actually store things in this and this is the reason why i bought these books we'll go ahead and remove this double-sided sticker and stick it to this corner just down to make sure it sticks all the way and then that's a baby this is a baby you i love this one this color the color is green and pink such a vibe mm, love it now this is a black girl's house okay in case you didn't know just wanted to show you the total of all the ones that i have so i got a lot because some are going to be in the living room some's going to be in my room but these are the ones that open up and i'm actually going to be able to put things in here for storage this prada one haven't decided where i want her to go but she will probably go in my room because fits the, the colors in my room this one is definitely going in my room because I have the marble, white, and gold vibe in my room. Love this one. Also has the storage. And this one was the original one I got. And look how they f that up, y'all. The ghetto. They be rushing. Them, they, anyway. They be rushing, honey. And look at this ghetto mess they sent me. What's that say? Voku? No. So they did send me the correct one for free. And I'm just going to use this one as, I mean, it holds stuff, so I'm still going to use it, but I'm just going to face it this way. 
right? So you can't see the whole in the mess in the back. Like, and I mean, they printed it three times. Don't make no sense. Guys, these are like just covers of real books. Like these are real books. Like you can buy this online, but they're super expensive. They're over a hundred dollars. Just like the colors and I like the vibe and I like that it's storage. So that's why I got mine. This is Miami. Oh my God, I just broke this one. Bro, my heavy ass fucking hand. It's okay, it's okay. It's fine, it's fine. This is- oh! eh, eh, eh. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Yeah. So, this is the Rihanna one. Isn't this fucking fly? Doesn't Rihanna look like a mermaid with this red swooped hair? Oh, and this hunchback and this nude. I had to get this one. What she looks like but she does not open this Kristen Dior one this is one of my favorite ones I ain't gonna lie Janelle Monet. that girl is so beautiful like black people on Vogue yeah I know that's right all right guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe you already know the deal I know I know I know that you're drunk yeah.